Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to add your library to your code in Visual Studio Code. Specifically guys, in this tutorial we are going to use Python and its libraries. So first of all, what we need to do is actually install Visual Studio Code. So how to do that? You can just open your browser and from there go to the URL section and search for code.visualstudio.com. If you hadn't opened this page or it was like a rare for you, all you need to do is go to your URL again, search for it, and click exactly from here to download. So it will open this page for you and here you can choose whether you have Windows, uh, Linux, or Mac OS, as you can see here. Then you can choose whatever format you want from user installer, system installer, zip, CLE, and so on. Now, guys, do not make this mistake. So if you want to image, you will find that here there is two logos that are completely like a little bit the same. This one is blue and this one is purple. Well, this one is the one that we are going to use, which is Visual Studio Code. And this one is pretty much similar, but it has some different functions, which is Visual Studio. Now, the thing that is missing between those is code. So make sure to look at Visual Studio Code. After you install it and you download it, etc. When you're done with it, all you need to do is go to here and let's open our file so let's open new text file or let's make a new file over here and let's name it for example tutorial.py and here it is so basically guys here all you need to do is pretty much click import and next to it, the name of the library that you want to import into here. If you don't have the library installed, all you need to do is click here, new terminal, wait for it until it opens, and then pip install, and install whatever library you want from your PC. Make sure that you have this library in your PC so you can install it directly in here. So yeah guys, that's how we can add libraries to Visual Studio Code. I hope to learn something from this video, and see you guys in the next tutorial. 